something about the way you move. Here we are again. Struggling with all my luggage because Florence is not here. I hate it when he doesn't travel with me. I'm going to Barcelona again. I feel like I've been in Barcelona this year so many times, but I love it so it's so I don't mind. The exciting thing now is that my mom is coming from Amsterdam. It's only for one and a half day, but still it's gonna be a lot of fun because she's gonna come watch the show because I'm doing the Pronovia's bridal show again. So yeah, I'm super excited that she's coming and I have one of my favorite places to go for breakfast in Barcelona. Actually, it's called Flex and Kill because they have a really, really, really good acebo. So once I arrive tomorrow morning, I take the flight overnight, I'm gonna rush over there with my mom to have breakfast and then do the fitting and the next day is the show and then I go back to New York. So that's the plan. Got this new luggage from Carly. Got this cute passport holder from Kales. Okay, it's really hard to do this with one hand. I feel like this year I've been more on the airport than in my actual apartment in New York City. What do I think about it? I think it's really fun once Lawrence is there because I think it's really important to like share stuff and I feel like now I experience a lot of things that I cannot really share with him. It's still fun, I'm still so grateful and so thankful that I'm able to like do this. And now this time my mom is coming, so that's gonna be nice. Of course in a normal job you still also, like an office job, you also go to your work alone, so it's not, I shouldn't like really complain about it, about being alone, but I'm just not the person that goes on an adventure by myself. The flight is at 8 p.m. so it's gonna be a night flight so hopefully I'm gonna fall asleep. My planning for next week for the upcoming days is to show then I fly back to New York then I have an event with Kiehl's and I'm obsessed with Kiehl's it's like this organic uh, skincare brand. around for a little bit because it's Sunday so all the stores are closed so we came back here and we're having some veggies and I have to say I'm really proud of my mom because she lost so much weight but that's not only because I'm proud because I think it's a whole mindset of like living a healthier lifestyle and that was also her mindset now right and I think that helped her a lot so don't like no strict or crazy diet, but just trying to live healthier. So that's what we're actually doing right now. <laughs> Cheers. With the zucchini. I got you. Oatmeal and peanut butter and pineapple and some coffee. 
my mom is getting her breakfast too right now over there and then i'll do rehearsal in a little bit because now it's eight and i think i have to be there at nine and we do some press stuff and then i'm off between one and five so i'll meet my mom then and then i go back at six o'clock for the show so yeah, that's the plan now we're having breakfast i got to the pranopia show they only did my harriet and they put it back i don't know what they did but it looks really weird it's so pretty this year like this is where people take the photos but then you guys should see the catwalk it's like insane i think the show is called in bloom wearing the right thong <laughs> Victoria's Secret represent Hey guys, so we just did rehearsal dress rehearsal and some press pictures and now I'm heading to the hotel and I think I'm gonna have quick lunch with my mom because we're getting a break from 1 till 5 and then I have to be back at 6 o'clock and then the show will be at 8.30 tonight and it was really pretty, it was like in a garden as I showed you guys with like the bridge and stuff but it's always a little nerve-wracking when you wear long dresses like that because you're always so scared to like step on them and like fall <laughs> um, so yeah, cross fingers that everything is gonna be alright We're back at Flex and Kill. We just had a salad and avocado toast, and that's the photo I posted on Instagram. But we also need our dessert. A delicious acai bowl. I got a rose because it's a special day in Spain. Do you remember what it's called? Uh, Saint Joseph. Saint Joseph's Day. So the women get a rose, as you can see here. They're selling roses everywhere, and then the men, they get books. So yeah, something like that. Or something like that. <laughs> so the show is about to start already. I think we're getting dressed in like 10 minutes. My mom's gonna go watch the show and bring the camera and hopefully film a little bit. Right? Bye. I'm doing a press day with Kiehl's today, one of my favorite skincare products. And of course, I'm with my favorite team, Sunny, Resident and Kiehl's. 
So here we go. Hello guys, so we're here at World of Heels and I'm gonna sit there uh, with the dermatologist and uh, the Kiehl's family and we're gonna talk about the newest products where I'm super excited about. It's super pretty in here. I'm gonna show you guys a little more in a little bit. And that is international <coughs> supermodel Romy. <laughs> Some of the clearly corrected treatment water on them until it like spreads to a sheet mask. Let's just do what you want to. Please don't be polite, cause I like your attitude. Let's forget about a curfew, cause all that is stuck in my head. After lunch with Daphne, that's what I did after Q's because I finished the event at like 1. So we went to the butcher's daughter for lunch and now I just got home, took a little snack and I'm gonna do SLT now. Training on a reformer where you do, you train strength, tone and lengthening. That's why it's called SLT. I have no energy at all but I booked it already so I think I'm just gonna do it. It's only 50 minutes, then I'm gonna go home take a shower, take my makeup off, take a bath, eat on the couch, order in and watch Netflix. That's my plan tonight. Lawrence is in the Netherlands though and I really, really, really miss him. He's there for a couple meetings in Amsterdam and he's coming back tomorrow night. I can't wait, I don't like to be alone in New York. Hey guys, I'm so happy I just came from Harry Josh. My hair was so dry and so long and it was just dead. But I didn't really want to cut it because I want to keep the length so bad. But it was just, I did highlights and I feel like it kind of dried out the end. So he did a treatment and he cut it just, he just did a little trim and it's so perfect and feels so soft again. So one happy girl. Make out, but pretty baby. 